So you've got an auto inflation system on your tractor, and but you don't quite trust it. You want to check the tire pressure manually, but you think it's a big deal. It's not really. You got to do something a little bit extra, but it's not all that difficult to do, and you can manually check your tires. These systems can fail. They can also be shut off in case there's a leak in the system so the tires don't deflate or you don't have that problem. So let me show you how to check the tire pressure when you have an auto inflation system. This is what they typically look like. Now I've already gone to the trouble to loosen this. That thing can be on there tight because most people don't take those off. So hang on a second here, let me put my other glove on. I'll show you how to do this. Okay, I've got my glove on. Like I said, I've already loosened up this. All you have to do is unscrew this just like you would a valve stem. This, by the way, is a TPMS sensor, so it monitors the tire pressure and uh, the temperature. Now, it's taking a little bit longer just because I got to go little bitty turns because I'm trying to hold a phone here too. Once this comes off, you'll hear a little bit of air release, but you've got this. It's just like the valve stem. So simply put the tire gauge to this. Let's see if I can do this with one hand which I won't be able to do. You just put the tire gauge onto that. It'll fit just perfectly. I'm trying to figure out how to do this. Hang on a second. Okay, this won't be perfect, but it just goes on there just like this. Boom, there you go. Tire checked. And then you just simply screw it back on. And as I'm putting this on and you're putting this back on, be careful not to cross thread it because that could lead to other problems you don't want to have to deal with. And then tighten it back up just to be safe. And that's it. Five minutes, you could have all your tires checked. Ten minutes most. So if you feel like checking your tires, don't be afraid to do it. Just make sure everything is back up there as tight as can be. Have a great day. Be safe. Don't forget to follow Freightliner on Facebook and Instagram. Don't forget to follow Team Run Smart on YouTube. Go to TeamRunSmart.com. Check us out there. Sign up for the free email newsletter. They'll send you an update once a week. Thanks for following. Be safe.